In some jurisdictions, a defendant who's negligently caused a plaintiff's injury can nevertheless escape liability if the plaintiff's own unreasonable conduct contributed to the injury. The case of Wright v. Norfolk and Western Railway Company provides an example. Riley Wright, an experienced dump truck driver, lived very close to the Maddox Street Railroad crossing. The crossing had no flashing lights, traffic signals, or gate, but was marked by two railroad signs, one on the street before the tracks and one at the tracks. One particular summer day, Wright hauled gravel in his truck over the crossing four times. On his fifth trip, Wright followed behind another dump truck. After the front truck successfully crossed the tracks, Wright drove slowly onto the tracks. But by that time, a train was less than 10 feet away and crashed into the center of the truck, severely injuring and disabling Wright. Wright's guardians, Maddie and Keith Wright, subsequently filed a negligence complaint against the owner of the railroad tracks, Norfolk and Western Railway Company. Due to his disability, Wright was unable to testify at trial. But eyewitnesses testified that the train's bell and whistle were sounding continuously on approach and that all of Wright's truck windows were closed. Wright's employer testified that Wright ran the air conditioner and played country music on the radio whenever he drove the truck. Wright's expert witness testified that the crossing lacked adequate warning signals and safety devices. He also testified that Wright's view of the train would have been limited due to the design of his truck and the angle at which Maddox Street crossed the tracks. Upon Norfolk's request, the judge instructed the jury to determine whether Wright was contributorily negligent. The jury found in Wright's favor and awarded him $4 million. However, the judge set aside the jury's verdict and entered judgment for Norfolk. Wright's guardians appealed to the Virginia Supreme Court.